Hey everyone, I'm Heather. Welcome to Heather's Creative Corner. Today I'm going to show you what's in my bag. I have this giant bag. We are doing a little staycation, my husband and I, and I'm going to bring along some things. And I thought I would show you what crafty, creative things I decided to bring. So here's the bag. Here's my little pop keychain. And let's get started. So I'm just gonna pull from out of here since there's no particular order. All right, so on top I have my project bag. And in here is my um, hook case that I always have with my hook stitch markers, uh, my notions case. This is what I was looking for, notions. And then my safety eyes. I have, this isn't crafty related, this, I guess this is just the bag I put this in. My migraine um, cephaly, cephaly, I'm not really sure how you say it. Um, if you get migraines, this is worth it. It's um, not a prescription, they sell it on their website and Amazon. Um, and it's, this is the charger and it just sticks to your forehead with these little like um, glue things. And then it gives you, um, it's like a TENS unit for, and you put it on your forehead, um, but it does work. Uh, it was recommended by my neurologist. So I'm bringing that with me in case I get a migraine while we're there. So there's that. I guess it didn't fit my other bag. I've got my cross stitch that I'm currently working on. I have my travel bag in case we go somewhere and I want to bring something with me. Um, this is my iPad case, my iPad. Here. my iPad so it's gonna go in here I really like this case um, I don't know if they still make it I got this a couple years back uh, but it's a Vera Bradley and then it's got a pocket here and it's got a zipper here pocket here some pockets here and here um, but it can, your tablet can fit in here. I don't remember if it was called like tablet case or iPad case. Um, but I just closed mine in here like this. And it's got a little handle. And it zips up. See? And I have a laptop case. Um, for my work computer that's very similar to this, but it's for a laptop. So there's that. I'm bringing some granny square yarn because I really want to work on the granny squares with this. Um, I'm bringing my Kindle. I just got a couple new books that I want to read. And I also have some crochet pattern books in here as well. So I just have the regular Kindle because it's the cheapest one and it works for exactly what I need. And this is my free pattern. It should be on my community tab still. And if it's not, it's on Instagram. And my Instagram handle is linked in my, um, I think it's a bio. I'm not sure what YouTube calls it, but it's linked there. And then it's just Heather's Creative Corner. But this is my free pattern for a Kindle case. And it's, um, personalizable so whatever size you need if in case you got the bigger kindle like a um scribe i think is the name of it or the uh, paper white maybe might even be bigger but so it's my my own pattern for the kindle case and i really like it okay. i used to sparkle all right what else do we have I have this that I almost thought about frogging and not finishing, but I think I'm just going to do it differently, maybe. It's supposed to be a, um, like a couch, like over the arm holder for like remotes and things. So you make it really long and then you fold it up and make pockets. Uh, but I've been working on this for like a year. So I thought about frogging it, but now I'm like, well, I've already got this much, might as well finish. So I'm bringing that to work on. It's very mindless. 
until you get to a certain length it's just single crochets so need to work on that bringing a bag of stuffing um i don't buy stuffing i do buy stuffing but right now i they recalled one of my kids pillows when they were a baby it's um it was a boppy lounger um, and you had to destroy it in order to get like the recall uh, so when I destroyed it, I kept all the stuffing, and that is what I've been using to stuff my amigurumi because I washed it before I destroyed it, so it's clean. And so I've been using that. So this is stuffing from that. And then once I do run out, I usually use just polyfill. But that's what I'm currently using. I brought this. I got this at the Target dollar spot. Um, friendship bracelets. I thought me and my husband could do that. I don't know. I'm trying to do something crafty and fun with him. And I don't know what he's going to want to do. So just kind of bringing a lot of stuff. The crochet's for me because he told me he's not interested in learning crochet. But I might try and teach him a little bit. But so I brought this friendship kit. And then I brought other stuff too. So I'll show you that. But that's one of the things. I have this. It's a pencil pouch. But it's got... Um, all kinds of stuff in here. I've got scissors, stitch markers, compression gloves, pins, safety pins, stitch markers, pom-pom maker, just random things. This stays in my crochet uh, cart and I just stuck it in there because I needed scissors. So it's got other stuff in it too. Scissors is why I grabbed this bag. What else do we have? I brought some color pencils. I really like these. I like the variety of color. I wish it had um, more. If the 100 pack goes on sale for Prime Day, I might get that one. And then I brought two coloring books because if he does want a color, then he can have his own coloring book. This one's Everyday Gratitude. It's probably from like Dollar General or something because it's the Benden brand. Dollar General, Dollar Tree. Um, just gratitude coloring. cute and then this one I think is from Michael's it's creatology I think that's Michael's uh this one's foil and I used to have one of these when I first moved into my own apartment like I don't know, 10 years ago I had colored one of these with my sister and then framed it but it's got foil and then you color inside of it and then you can frame it so got that one I've been doing coloring pages, but I figure for travel that a coloring book might be better to travel with um, instead of like a printed coloring page. I am bringing my clover hooks. This is the rest of the sizes. Oh, this the back. This is the rest of the sizes that aren't in my notions case. All my clover hooks. And there's another hook in here it goes with that project so it's stuck in that project this is the eight millimeter and i've got um eight millimeters from the fire that i really like but i'm not taking that with me on a trip what else oh my neck light i don't know how the lighting's gonna be at home i have a lamp right by my bed I, right by my bed that i use um, I like this. I do wish that this was skinnier. So if you're in the market for a neck light, um, Legal, I think is the name of the brand with the one that's a little bit skinnier. This is the Glucoscent. I do like it. It works well. Um, it just, I don't love how wide the neck part is, but it's not bad. I still use it and I like it. Let me turn it off. I don't want to turn off. There it goes. There's that. We're almost done. Um, I've got some diamond painting. I brought two kits in case he wants to do some. Uh, so that I have enough of the little stick things. I don't know what they're called. So I brought plants and princesses. Maybe he'll want to do a princess. I don't know. But I brought both. There's the plants. I don't think he wants to do that. If not, I'll do it. Whatever. 
I just don't know what I'm gonna feel like doing. So there's no way we're only gonna be gone. We're leaving Thursday afternoon and we're coming back Saturday evening. Uh, so like three days. This is way more than I could do in three days, but I didn't know what I would feel like doing. So I'm bringing everything. Um, I have a couple Dollar Tree macrame kits. Maybe he'll want to do macrame. Maybe I'll want to do macrame. Um, I have a pencil sharpener for the color pencils. And this pocket here. Got my Kindle charger. And my iPad charger. I think it's still upstairs. So I need to pack that. This is my reminder now. Go pack that. And then the last thing, I'm packing some wool skits because they're great for travel. So I have, I've been wanting to do all the baby animals. So I brought those with me. So I brought the baby shark, the sharkling. I brought the piggy bank, which is the tiny pig basically. So that one. And I'm bringing this one, the Bella the Kangaroo. And, suck it inside here. I'm bringing the baby Bella. So, I'll probably start with, I wonder if there's something in here. Oh, it's the eyes. I didn't know I'd stuck the eyes in here. Okay, so. Baby Bella, baby pig, baby shark, and I'll probably start this, but I think I'm going to do the babies first, and then work on the big one, because they'll get done really quickly. I had this one in the bag because it was open. If you don't know what the, the big kits come with, they come with the password, which I put away, um, and then they come with the yarn and the stuffing. And there's eyes in here, but the eyes go to this kit. They don't go to this one. And that is all. That is everything that I'm bringing. I will let you know, possibly do an update of what I did, what me and my husband did, if he decides to do something. Um, I would say maybe I'll try and teach him to crochet a little bit, but this is an intermediate kit, so they don't teach you really. But maybe I can show him. Maybe he can work on it with me for fun. I don't know what he's gonna wanna do. I don't know what I'm gonna have time to do. We were talking about um, maybe going mini golfing, maybe going to um, one of those pottery painting places. I really wanna do that, and I've been asking to do that for a while. So maybe we'll do that, talk about mini golf. We're gonna go out to dinner. Uh, my husband wants to hike on the Katy Trail. Um, I don't know what else. So we'll see what we do, what we have time to do, but I thought it'd be fun to do some crafty stuff with him because he doesn't ever do those things with me. So, yeah. Um, I will see you guys when I get back from my trip. Thanks for stopping by. Like and subscribe if you like what you see. See you next time. Bye.